Hey guys, Steph here. So I'm doing a video, um, first of all it's a design team card as well as a video response for Cindy for Kiddo's daughter's birthday. Um, and I'm in a different room so the lighting's going to be different. Um, quick update, my dad is home from the hospital because um, they said there's nothing more they can do. The cancer ate holes through the vertebrae L1 and L2. So, um, he's resting, so that's why I might be a little quiet today. Um, because he's sleeping right now, so that's my little update on that. So please keep him in your prayers. Um, so for my card, I used the Whimsy Stamp We Snip It. And I got this at Hot Rods Boutique from Brittany H. on Etsy, and I'll put the link down below. And these are the Copic colors I used. I will put them on my blog soon. And um, for Cindy for Kiddos Challenge, it was to make a birthday card for her daughter and to use the color yellow. So this is the card that I made. And I just had fun with it. So first of all, it's on paper tray ink yellow cardstock, and it is uh, five and a half by six inches. And then here is my image that I used. I gave her some pink hair because fun little fairy has different colored hair. And I put stickles on her wings, and I used glossy accents on her eyes, and I used clear wink of Stella on her shoes and on the bottom of the mushroom. The mushroom is part of the image, so. And I fussy cut it out and popped it up. And I think she came out cute. And then my pattern papers, which is this blue here and this um, flower pattern here, is from American Crafts Every Day, and I got this at Target. And also this pattern paper here too. And so first for this blue pattern paper, I used this MFT Dynamics Sunray die. And I just turned it sideways, ran it through with the blue pattern paper, and then let the yellow shine through. And then I inked up part of it with some mustard seed distress ink. And then for the next part, um, these sunflowers, I knew I wanted big flowers, um, because, you know, I wanted her to be a little fairy because she's on a mushroom, so I wanted the flowers to look much bigger than her, so I used this stampendous daisy thanks, and, oh, these animals are driving me crazy, that cat just jumped by me, it's hard being in a different room, um, so I stamped them out. I Copic colored them, fussy cut them out, and added some clear Wink of Stella to the centers. And then um, for the little fox down here, I used Lawn Fawn's Critters in the Forest. And I just Copic colored the little fox and fussy cut him out, and added some glossy accents to his nose. And then where did that go? Hold on. I'm looking for that stamp. Where did I put it? Got it. Okay. Look at this. Hold on. Hi, kitty. <laughs> I'm telling you. She's going nuts because I'm right here. So for the little mushroom house, I used... Paper Smooches Fanciful Fall, and I just love that little mushroom house. And I Copic colored it, and then I added um, the Ranger white enamel accents to the white parts of the mushroom. If you can see, it's shiny on the white, and some glossy accents on the door knob thing. And then just fussy cut it and put it out. And then, um, the little butterfly here is from this sticker doodle color box sticker set. 
And then for some of the vellum clouds, not all of them, but the ones that you can see a little more clearly, I used this sticko sticker sheet. And then for the sun in the middle, I don't know how well you'll be able to see on here, but it's got little vellum rays and then some vellum sparkly clouds. I used this Jolie sticker set. Stop, cat. Sorry. This is going to be a hot mess video. So, use those. And then for my sentiment up here, I used Sweet November stamps from CC Designs, a little bit of magic. And stamped it onto the pattern paper with VersaFine ink and then clear embossed it. And it says Loving Wishes and Fairy Kisses. And I cut it into a banner. And then I added a few little dewdrops in yellow here and here and here and here. And I think that's it for the front. And then for the inside, all I did was continue in the pattern paper. And then for the little deer, I used the lawn fawn into the woods. And I just love that little deer. It's so cute. And go bit colored and fussy cut it out. And then for my sentiment, happy birthday to you. I use CC Designs Amy R Winged Greeting Sentiments. And then I stamped these wings here from Just Right Stamps um, Quiet Moments. And I just stamped the little wings in um, Memento Lilac Posies. So that is my card. Um, I hope that both Brittany and Cindy like it, and I'm sorry about the angle and lighting in this video and the crazy animals, so <laughs> that is it for right now. I will be back later, and um, when I get a chance later, I'm going to write down and get all the um, giveaway entries together. It's been kind of crazy, but that will be done this week, I promise, so that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Bye!